Three days a week, Doris Kaplan enjoys a nice, brisk walk. But not long ago, episodes of irregular heartbeat slowed down her pace. I had to be careful not to go in remote places. I didn't want to get an attack in, uh, in an unfamiliar uh, surrounding. Doris's heart palpitations didn't show up on an EKG. So Sarasota Memorial cardiologist Dr. Walter Hepp used a specialized test called electrophysiology, or EP study. The EP study is uh, essentially a diagnostic tool. It's used in assessing patients who present with uh, symptoms that are difficult to figure out. Arrhythmias are changes in the normal beating pattern of the heart. Some can be controlled with medication. More serious irregularities can actually cause sudden cardiac death. If you survive a sudden death episode due to a dangerous rhythm, there's a one in three chance in the next year that that rhythm will come back. Which is why the EP test is critical. Catheters are placed in strategic areas of the heart to measure electrical activity. Like a high-tech road map, the catheters track the cause of the arrhythmia. Just like taking your car in to be analyzed by a mechanic, we'll look at each component of the heart's electrical system. Once the source is found, proper treatment can be administered right in the catheter lab. I play golf three times a week. I walk three miles a day, and I, uh, I live a normal life. Now Doris Kaplan enjoys her daily activities without skipping a beat. This is Todd Callis reporting.